How'd you know to wear like that? How'd you know to turn up that song? How'd you know them little tore up jeans was gonna tear me up, turn me on? I always wanted to be a cowboy since I was knee high. Yeah, I was about three or four when I got on my first horse. Boot Barn is, is something I came across. So I moved to Nashville, Tennessee when I was 18 and didn't know a person. And so Boot Barn's one of those places where I just started shopping and had what I needed, you know, jeans, shirts, hats, boots. You gotta have a bunch of them. So I needed to, I needed to rotate clothes. It's one of those things you don't want to be caught in the same shirt too many times over. You, people think you have one shirt. Before I ever worked with them musically, I've shopped there and then it was actually through social media that we had connected two years ago. Like, it's almost like we're family now. It's a new adventure every weekend when we go out somewhere and like, I don't know, that's half the fun of it. Just the rural lifestyle and the freedom of being able to go out on your own land and, you know, kind of just explore around or do what you want, you know? You got on what's gonna get me high How'd you know what I'm thinking right now? How'd you know what I was about to say? And how'd you know to whisper in my ear Let's take this party back to my place I started writing songs and it came out country but I didn't know country music. I listened to it and I thought, what in the world? Like, where did this come from? I've always dreamt about, like, having a single on the radio and, and playing at the Grand Ole Opry. I just got to do that. Like, those are all dreams that I've had, but actually, like, standing in the circle or actually hearing your song on the radio, those moments are such mountaintop moments, and you can't describe that feeling. So I was very active in music. Just, it kind of kept going. Once I finally finished my first song, I remember the feeling. I recorded it in this little tape deck. And being able to play that back was the coolest feeling ever, and it's addicting. And, and, and that addiction never goes away. You can sit down, write a song, and create something that didn't exist. Yeah.